Belted high and deep into right center. Kiermaier looks up. Gone! Solo shot to right center, and he keeps it up. 53 now on the year, as the Yankees will grab a one to nothing lead. And about the only silver lining to this one from a defensive standpoint is the fact that it came with the bases empty leading off an inning. So you can survive it when this guy's hitting just solo shots. It's when he's doing his damage with two or three guys on base that things can really get out of hand in a hurry. Leading off the inning, Evan Longoria, as they'll look to get something going here and even this game up. And in a pretty close game so far, they'd love to see this guy get on base so they can get a rally started to get back in this thing. On the ground and right at the shifted infielders. And a diving effort there, but it'll come up empty. It's a base hit. So make it two hits for him in this one as he's on base here. Giovanni Urshela will dig in here with the bases loaded now and their best opportunity yet to get on the board. And they've had a few chances and come up empty, so they can't let this one get away from them. Hit hard to short. Here's Castro for one. Relay to first in time, and just like that, this side is retired. A golden opportunity to get on the board here goes for naught. Jim Imro stands in, coming off a solo homer in his previous trip. I can't imagine they're going to give him anything to hit this time around. And he'll power in a fastball that time at 94 for strike one. And you know what? These days, so many guys are throwing in the high 90s. It makes those mid to low 90s guys easy. But I'll tell you what, if he mixes his pitches well, it can still be plenty fast to have to deal with. Has to be thinking strikeout here. Curveball bounces, and this one gets away. And he's going to make it up to third here as he advances on the wild pitch. A ball and two strikes. Here it is. High and deep to right center. Back goes Kiermaier at the track. Gone. A fence scraper, but still good for three runs. So a three-run shot to right center field, his second of the game, and that'll stake the Yankees to a 5-0 lead now. Well, it seems to me like we've seen this before. His second home run of the ball game. And it would seem to me that he hit that one harder than he did the last one. So he's definitely locked in. 